Welcome to the project demonstration of non-invasive glucometer. So in this video, we are going to monitor the glucose levels of a person from his fingertip by scanning the uh, blood intensity levels by uh, calculating the glucose levels based on the blood intensity, nothing but the blood density. As we know that uh, if the heavy uh, glucose was present inside the person's blood, then the density is more and the low glucose levels, low density. Based on this, uh, receiving light intensity by using the Arduino you know we are going to estimate the glucose levels and that will be displayed on the LCD screen continuously and the same data will be sent to the mobile phone through this HC05 Bluetooth module. We have interfaced this sensor uh, which is a customized one at A4 and A5 and 0 and 1 for the Bluetooth module and LCD interface to the pin number 2 to pin number 7 of this Uno board. So before in uh, demonstration install this Blue Terminal application from the Play Store and after that on the power supply to this power supply as we are using this adapter which will take the 100, 100 to 250 volts of uh, AC and just on the power supply otherwise you can use your country adapter which will provide a 12 volts DC input to this ok that's very important initially it will blink very fast and uh, initially you need to pair to the mobile HC05 so I am pairing that right now see search for the new device so wait it will show the uh, it's a 05 right okay this is only first time set up in your mobile phone once you pair from this uh, settings password is 1234 it will be there in your history the next time onwards directly you can go to the application you can see that it's a 05 just click on that you can see the device connected no finger as of now so just when i place the finger don't move the finger while you uh, reading uh, getting the readings from uh, your finger there's a glucose levels place it calm and wait for some time right now the readings will be displayed continuously. If I move the finger, then the readings fluctuates more. Uh, if you keep it uh, normal without any movements, the readings will become normal after some time. So, right, so, so you can need to push it hard, just place it gently on the sensor. Right. Once it's stabilized, uh, then you will get the faster readings. Wait uh, till the reading stabilized. Right, we can see that. It will be stabilized at the 100 to 115. So once I move the finger or any uh, like uh, moment, then the readings will be fluctuates. at 90 and 105 is the normal values right okay so like this it will be stabilized uh, values right 